Josie here at Kern Laser System. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Now we've gotten a couple requests to cut some thick acrylic, so today we are going to be cutting and engraving some three quarter inch acrylic on our 500 watt Optiflex laser system. The last time we cut acrylic, we didn't really care what the sides or the backside looked like because we were only seeing the top side of the part. But today, we want to make sure that our part is clean and smooth on all sides. To do this, we are going to slow down on our cut and we are going to take a couple extra steps to remove those tick marks on the back side. When cutting thick acrylic for a flame polish edge quality, we will want to raise the material off the bed using these acrylic spacers. This is going to help remove those tick marks on the back side from the reflection of the honeycomb. But first, we want to make sure that we cut our part on the paper to see where we need to place the spacers. Now we will place our spacers along the inside edges of the part and around the outside to hold up our material. It is important that the spacers hold up the individual part as well as the block of leftover material so nothing shifts during or after the cut. After we have the spacers in place, we want to cut the part one more time without the material on top. When the beam hits the edge of the spacers, it can burn the paper surrounding it. If we were to be cutting our material, the beam would hit those edges of paper and burn to result in a possible messy cut underneath the material. Now, we'll put our material on top of the spacers. When the material is secure on the spacers, let's optimize our settings. Here is the file that we will be cutting today. So now we will send the dinosaur over to KCAM using our selection export tool. three quarter inch acrylic on the 500 watt laser, we will be going 0.2 inches per second at 60% power. Our PSI will be set to about 20. And we set this PSI low so we do not fog the acrylic. For etching our logo, we will be going 60 inches per second at 7% laser power and we will want to make sure that our DPI is set to 600 and our PSI will stay at 15. We have the five inch focal length assembly in, as well as the wide nozzle. We are prepared to engrave and cut the acrylic.
for today's video. Thank you all for watching. If you have any questions or comments about flame polishing acrylic, please leave them down below. We'll be happy to chat with you in the comments. Make sure you like and subscribe to stay up to date with all things Kern Lasers, and we'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.